Yes, Jeff, tell us about this, because in researching the history of the zoo, learned that a, a very prestigious award uh, was, was bestowed upon the zoo for the elephant program. Tell us about it. It's the Edward H. Bean Award uh, from AZA, and it attempts to recognize significant long-term propagation efforts that produce multiple successful births. So we checked all those boxes, and the important thing is it demonstrated that it doesn't take the big zoo with the big budget and the big staff to make a significant contribution to conservation. I love that. I mean, that's really a message that you could take to everybody. Not even you don't even have to be you know a billionaire or a big philanthropic yes. uh, bank account. You can just do a little bit just by visiting a zoo. You are actually helping conservation efforts. It's, it's uh, habitat loss primarily that's uh, causing the decline of both the African and the Asian elephant. Uh, there, there's uh, all kinds of research being being done. Uh, uh, we, we produced Haji, the, the very first elephant in the world by artificial insemination, was produced right here at Dickerson Park Zoo. So, uh, and were you both involved in that? Oh, yes. So say that again, the very first elephant, first elephant in, the world. in the world, born by artificial insemination, born here at Dickerson Park Zoo. That's so cool. What an amazing part of our history.